<sighs> okay. Blah, blah, blah. Purchase some ant poison from the Silsby feed store. It will kill 60% of the fire ant beds each week. Jiminy Sean's Uncle Ranch has about 70 million fire ant beds. Write this situation with an exponential function. So we're going to put 70 million right here. That's our starting number. Let me do it down here so we can see it better. F of X equals 70 million parentheses. Now then, he kills 60%, so we do 100 minus 60 is 40. 40% 40 is left, so the common product will be 0.4. And then to the X. So this right here would be our function. So it's going to start at 70 million. So 0, 70 million. And this graph would just barrel down like this, right? And eventually get, go to the x-axis. Okay, how many will be at the end of one year? Which is 52 weeks, right? So this is going to be 70,000 or 70 million parentheses 0.4 to the 52nd, right? Okay, so let's graph this. So I'm going to hit Control T to, to get rid of the graph. Control T, my, my table's gone. Now then, think of something bad, delete, delete, delete. Boom, that bad thought's gone. Hit tab, and then 70 million, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, parentheses, 0.4, caret X. Hit enter, and I'm not gonna see any of the graph, or the Y intercepts at 70 million, right? Okay, now then, I want 52 weeks, so I'm going to hit uh, Control T, and then I got to go down to 52, right? Who could get there first? Go all the way to 52. Notice the number's getting smaller. There's 52 right there. 52 is 1, 4, 5, 6, and then 1, 2, 3, 4. the equation in right. I might have had not enough zeros. Let me redo the equation. Control T. I think I put too many zeros in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I got it right. Oh, I did. I didn't do the exponent X. So I need delete, delete, delete. That's why. So I'm going to punch in uh, tab, then 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, parentheses, 0.4, and then I have to punch caret x, not caret, caret x, then hit enter, and now it's going to work. Now I got my 0.4x. Okay, so I'm going to hit Control T to get my table, and then I'm going to go down to 52. Notice the numbers are getting smaller here. Whoa, so we're going to have zero amp beds. Zero amp beds happens actually at 20 weeks. So do you see at 20 weeks it goes underneath a 1? So at 17 weeks, we're at 12 amp beds, then 4 amp beds, 1 amp. So at 20 weeks, we're at 0 amp beds. So right here, at 20 weeks, we would be at 0. So 52 would be 0 amp beds, wouldn't it? So 0 amp beds at 52 weeks. Okay, so the y-intercept, 70 million, is the starting number of beds of amp beds that is. The common product is 0.4 and that's going to make the number of beds go down. The asymptote is still the x-axis. The domain is going to go from 0 to 52 and the range is going to go from 70 million or from 0 from the bottom to the top. 0 to 70 million. Sorry about that that I typed it in wrong.